Perfect drift. Now we've got a finite set of tires, right? Also limbs and lives. Well, what's the point of having them then? I'll lend you 30 if you pay me back by tomorrow. Done. Thank you, Suvi. Someday I'll find out why you're always strapped for credits. Okay, bundle up, people. I'll stay on my nice warm ship. Take her down, Callow. We designated this planet Habitat 6. Original readings suggest that it had a breathable, nitrogen rich atmosphere and oceans of H2O. I take it that's no longer the case. All H2O in Habitat 6, fold to the Angarai, is ice. And those oceans, frozen over completely. There goes the dream of a seaside property.
That's a pretty intense blizzard. LZ is on the windward side of the mountain. Conditions are bad. I'm tracking gale force squalls. to get out and push? Very funny, Ryder. Extreme cold is detected, Pathfinder. Secluded. Blizzard provides cover. Great for a hidden base. Keep going, Ryder. Try not to make any sudden movements. You're probably being watched. How many snipers do you think I got trained on me? to talk to Commander Anyik when we arrive. Very impressive vehicle, yes? We call it the Nomad. I'm an amateur mechanic myself. Build vehicles for my people. Upload this schematic for your mechanic, with my compliments. They can upgrade your vehicle shielding once you find the needed components. I'll have him vetted. Thanks. My pleasure, human. You can find some of what you need here on Vault. The rest, out and about.
Good to see you again, Commander Dozil. And you, Jarl. This is the alien. The one you think can help us. Yes. This is Ryder, of the Andromeda Initiative. I am Anyik Dozil. Remember the name, because if you betray us, I will kill you myself. Be assured that what I do to you will make the stars turn their faces and grow dark. Totally understood. Everyone wants the stars to keep shining, right? We're in agreement, then. If you wish to prove yourself, be an ally in our fight against the Ket. Despite our best efforts, their growing forces remain a threat to our people. Speak to our lookouts, who watch the valley. They'll know where our need is dire. Jarl, watch them. And be careful yourself, my friend. <clears throat> I always am. Apologies, Pathfinder. I'm a little busy at the moment. Carl, my friend. Welcome home, brother. Looks like supplies aren't getting through to the Resistance. Olisk is in charge of requisitions. We should speak with him. Pathfinder, something I can do for you? You the requisitions officer? I hear you're having supply issues. Of course not. I don't know what you've heard, but everything is running fine. Your communications say otherwise. You haven't received a shipment in weeks. Those data pads were encrypted. How did you... <sighs> I need to keep this news contained. No one knows the shipments have stopped. If word gets around, we'll have a serious morale drop. I need to investigate this quietly. You have any leads? Not much. The supplies make it planet side, but never reach the base. The obvious answer is the Ket. Sabotage is their style. We changed our drop point, but no luck. I can't send someone to investigate without word getting around. I guess there's no avoiding it eventually. I can take a look at the drop point. That way no one will panic. I can't sanction an official search, but I also can't stop you from investigating on your own. The nav point for the last drop location is in my personal console. You seem to be adept at decryption. So I'll let you figure out the rest. Decryption successful, Pathfinder. Updating your nav system with a supply drop point. That's the planet, with everything on it. We don't win a war without good organization. From this room, we keep track of our brothers and sisters in the field. Lord, hostile patrol approaching. Hope they... Give me a patrol soon. You think I'll see any yet? Not likely. Pathfinder, I was told to expect you. Dove your cars, Chief Intelligence Officer. I want to brief you on Vold. Any questions about the planet? Ask away. How does the Resistance plan to win this war? We don't have the forces to fight a planet-wide war. Our only hope is a strategic strike. The center of all Ked operations on Vold is across the valley. If we take down their command structure, it will weaken them. At least, that is our hope. Is that a map of Vold? A living map, yes. Every region on the planet is represented. Updated in real time, as we get information from scouts and contacts. You can see the nearest Dara, the Jara Tejiks, and Yarnik, 
The archaeological dig the Kenham occupied. The bright spots on the map are those cities. Cities under siege by the Ket, yes. The largest, Destroyer, was our capital. Was? It's hard to think of a city as a capital when it's just a maze of empty streets and burnout buildings. But buildings can be rebuilt. We are more than our cities. You mentioned the word Dar. What does it mean? Well, translated directly, it means rock foundation. A Dar is smaller than a city, but larger than a settlement. There are several out here. Angara who live in Dara are combat trained, ready for anything. I guess they need to be. They take pride in defending themselves. But the Ked are bolder lately. The Dara are their new target. We've had to change our tactics to protect them. More patrols with the Dara means fewer raids on Ked camps. The Ked know this and use it against us. Tell me more about Australia. It's the recent focus of Ked attacks. They think they can break our spirit by tearing down our walls. The Ked learned that we fight to the death, and they would rather we submit. So they destroy our Dara, our homes. They drive us into the cold and expect us to give in. They underestimate the Angara. I think I have enough info. If you need anything else, I'll be here. Double dose of summer, quick! Yes, what is it? You're that alien they've been talking about on comms, aren't you? Why are you standing here? Shouldn't you be talking to the commander? I'm Pathfinder Ryder with the Andromeda Initiative, from... Wonderful. You're from far away. Do they have magical healing where you're from? Nothing more advanced than what you have. Then where you're from is useless to me right now. Stand over there. The commander said the alien wanted to help, but we need it. The emergency caches, maybe. Emergency caches? This is a war zone. Ked attacks are always a risk. Wounded. There's probably a cache of emergency medical supplies nearby. No substitute for real medical attention, but you'll survive long enough to reach it. Problem is the caches are empty right now. Restrained and no one's been out there to replenish supplies. There's no time to waste. I'll help with whatever you need. Supply crates are stacked by the wall over there. Directions to the caches are with them. You have a vehicle? Of course. Good. Get going. If you need patching up, you'll have to wait. A patrol just came through and I need to see to them. Is it just you here? Volunteer medics are hard to come by, especially ones who can handle Vold. It's actually warm in here. Those heaters work pretty well. We don't use them for heat. They generate artificial sun, so we don't go dark. What do you mean, go dark? Right. I suppose you wouldn't know about that. Our bodies generate energy from sunlight. If we don't get enough, our immune systems weaken and our bioenergy slows. We go dark. It can't be easy living in a place like this. Between the cold and the lack of sun, it's tough to keep morale up. Most of us come from Aya or Haval, so it's a big adjustment. Immunity drops. People get sick. But if the civilians in the settlements can live here without complaint, so can we. I'll come back if I need anything. I'll be here. Jarl, have you come back to us? Briefly. And these must be the strangers I've heard so much about. You know, if not for Jarl, I might kill you. <laughs> this is my friend, Maisie. She 
help supply the resistance. That must be difficult out here. Jahal's the brave one. How do you get supplies with the cat everywhere? The same way we came. There are caves and hidden paths all over the world. It's hard to fly in, so my children run most items through the caves, little by little. Children? Their size makes it hard for the cat to detect. We all do what we can out here, even children. How do you feel about Ephra? Some speak ill of the man, but his plan is bold and the resistance is important. I'll do what I can to help until I can't help anymore. Are you selling anything we could use? I have almost nothing left. What I do have, we need if we're going to stand any chance against the Ket. Maybe if you clear that Ket station on the south road, I'd be able to bring in more and spare something for you. Good luck and stay safe. Just make sure you return Jarl to us. They all say the same thing. The Resistance is missing supplies. These are the emergency medical supplies the doctor mentioned. We have to get them to the caches. Sam, you saving the location data? Of course, Pathfinder. Clear. Proceed to objective. You have questions? I think I have. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. They know I'm not gonna eat them, right? Let's try to make a good first impression. <laughs> it's so good to be back. I have friends here. Yeah, I never get Environmental I temperatures are within acceptable life. limits. You're so good at guilt. Whoa! Didn't mean to sneak up on you. Your commander said you could show us the valley. Seek. I don't want to talk to it. You talk to it. Ryder has a name. You named it? How do you even tell them apart? Stars, Beniska, just stop talking. Yeah, we can show you the valley. What are you looking for? I'm here to help your people. Know anyone who needs it? We've got reports from Hajara about someone trying to rescue a kidnapped family. See those red lights? That's it. If you're here to help, like the commander says, you could start there. Anything else? Those red lights. You said that's Hijara? Yes. Hijara Station. One of the Dar in the valley. It's a small community, mostly scientists. There's people there that might need help, if you haven't checked it out already. How does anyone live out here? Why so surprised? We've adapted to this weather. Those lights are conspicuous. Don't the cat attack? We've adapted to that, too. The Ket want to take us alive, so we fight to the death. It seems to deter them. What's that alien facility on that mountain over there? That's the Ket Command Center. We have constant eyes on it. What's its purpose? 
It controls cat operations on the entire planet. There's always ships coming and going. I came face to face with the Prefect there. Meanest, motherless Bissan I ever saw. Even the cats seemed afraid. We don't have much intel on her, though. Do you know of any remnant sites or ruins? Uh, I think so. Actually, I don't know. Seek, do you ever read the dailies? No, you'll tell me if I need to know something. So where is it? Tall lights, over on your right somewhere. I'll let you get back to your work. Yeah, you behave. We're watching you. Tempest, we're gonna need the Nomad. My position. Deploying forward station. Good luck, Ryder. Activating automated forward station deployment. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Okay, Sam, what's Vold got for us? Cat activity appears to be centered around this large central command post. According to Resistance Intelligence, the base coordinates all Cat military efforts on Vold. And taking it down will cripple their operations. In theory. However, given the trouble the Angara Resistance has had infiltrating the base, it will not be a simple task. I recommend a more cautious approach that starts with the investigation of smaller Cat installations. Any suggestions on how to get on Ephra's good side? Resistance dispatches indicate there is someone in Hojara who needs help. We could visit Tekix, a larger and more established Angara Dar that is nearby. Sounds good. Thanks, Sam. Pathfinder, Vault's temperature range is fixed well below freezing, with pockets of even more severe conditions. This necessitates the use of the Nomad. I advise against prolonged exposure to the cold. Got it. Don't crash the car. Our scans have detected remnant monoliths, which suggests the presence of a vault. And that means we might be able to melt this ice cube. All right, we've got our work cut out for us. Let's get going. Follow the lights, Ryder. Trust me. Town Hill's always more fun. It corners a little poorly, doesn't it? Your vehicle? I swear I will turn this car around. should be manageable now. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface.
Here they come! Why were Ingara attacking us? Pathfinder, I detect a data pad nearby. Axul? Should I know about it? That's a conversation for another time. Pathfinder, I have informed Olisk. The drop point is secure. Good. The Resistance should get their supplies now. Junk might be something useful. Undocumented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. Camp ahead contains cat life forms, Pathfinder.
guy is special, a unique, once in a lifetime leader that understands strategy, the enemy, and a fighter's heart. Under his command, we see more success against the Ket. Angara greatly respect him. Good enough for me. I and many others have never known a world without Ket. The Resistance fights so our children may one day be free. They're a tough bunch. Lots of respect for the Angara. The way they fight, <laughs> it's almost Krogan. Activating automated forward station deployment. Our histories say there were once flower meadows on Vault. Colors we didn't have names for. Whatever you think of it, this is a beautiful planet. Thinking about a frozen moon I was once stranded on, almost lost my good toe. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Jara is a research station, mostly focusing on Vold's geology. Let's see if someone here needs help. High-powered communications array, most likely for planet-wide communications. Makes sense. Anything on that interference the researcher talked about? I am detecting a signal. It is faint, but this equipment is sensitive. Pathfinder, I also observe a regular pattern in this emitted signal. It may be artificial. You don't mean... Ket? Are you saying the Ket are disrupting our comms? We must look into this. We can't just attack an entire Ket base. So you're just giving up on Nilch? He was your best friend. You're that alien people have been talking about. Some say we can't trust you. But if you're here to fight Ket, that's good enough for me. I appreciate the vote of confidence. Ket kill people. They take our families and we never see them again. Anyone who fights against that has to be better than them. So, will you fight them? I know the location of the labor camp where they took my uncle. I'll get your uncle. Here's the nav point of the labor camp. Please hurry. Nilch may not have much time. Try to start something. We're all combat trained by the Resistance and prepared to die. And try not to disturb our data probes. Our research is valuable, though it may not mean much to you. 
What's your focus out here? Glacial movement, seismology, climate, anything Aya needs from us. Resources are tight, so our scientists know a bit of everything. That way, we're prepared for anything. Are you in charge here? Lead researcher. Worked as a seismologist on Aya before I volunteered for Hijara. You volunteered? We all did. Aya is fine, but all that green gets boring. I can't speak for the rest, but I came here for the adventure. So far, Vold has lived up to my expectations. Always a new mountain to scale. How long has this station been around? Only a few years. This used to be Ket territory before the Resistance pushed them out. We've discovered a wealth of resources the Ket protected out here. Metals, minerals, even a new species of edible cold-weather fungus. All that was hidden under the ice? And more. We've only scratched the surface. I'll come back if I need anything. I'll be here. Well, I haven't seen many of your kind around here, but I've heard lots about the Pathfinder from my friends on Aya. All good things, I hope. So far. Do you get much business out here? I do all right. The trick is to not stay in one place too long. I travel between here and Techix. Sometimes they even make it up to the resistance camp. Isn't that dangerous with the cat all around? I've had a few close calls, but they haven't caught me yet. The stars are on my side. I'll take a look at your stock. Got plenty of supplies. Found an abandoned supply pack on the Eastern Plain. Janleth, I'm pretty sure there's something here. They were probably affected by the scourge. The microbe variety... The numbers check out. I, I don't know what else I can do to strengthen my argument. I... Oh, hello. You're that rider alien everyone's talking about. What can I do for you? You said something about ice talkers? What are those? Oh, that's something of a joke between me, Janleth, and everyone who went to school with us in Australia. One of our classmates was at an old archaeological dig and thought he heard a voice through the ice. Two months later, another group claimed they heard the same thing. An angry voice. What was it? Too much Malay. That's what Janleth says. Now it's become something of a joke between us. Reports. Can't imagine anything here interests you. Just exploring to familiarize myself, or see if someone needs help. And try Skiot if you haven't already spoken to him. He's been looking for someone to help him. Now, is there anything you need from me? You were saying something about ice talkers? Huh? Don't let anyone hear you. Stupid story that started years ago when Dinor and I were students in Australia. Talk to Dinor. He knows more about how that tale spread. What are you doing with this giant block of ice? That was cut out from below Hijara. We're right above an inland sea and the ice goes deep. Very deep. 
Everything under the first layer was perfectly preserved from a time before the scourge. There's a lot we can learn from the composition of the deeper layers. Microbes, ancient life forms, all untouched by the scourge. I won't disturb your work. Only the cat showed us the same courtesy. is falling, Pathfinder. So I told him I can't the ambient temperature is normal. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Remnants have overtaken this area, Pathfinder. It may be worth investigating.
life. Take a chance joining the initiative. Why would anyone at the start of theirs join up with strangers like us? Besides, who says I'm old? Who says I'm dying? I don't think I said that. You did. I'm certain. I didn't. Now you're saying I'm deaf. Right up. Not getting hey, you're not wrong, Jal. I am old, but I got a lot of living left. I'd live here, but then I could probably live anywhere. <sighs> Did your people have plans to settle here? You seem easily affected by the cold. Heads up, looks like a Keck construct. below normal temperatures. Dead things. Is it for respect? A celebration of life through reverence of death? We are nearing the nav point provided by Sokar Iso on Aya. Fight happened here. No bodies, though. I detect traces of weapons fire consistent with Cat's technology. Cat. Great. Found them. Scans reveal these crates contain Angaran weapons. Oh, really now? Oh, did Sokka not mention he helps us out sometimes? <laughs> I recognize him. That's Keldo, one of Sokka's suppliers. And here's the ambush.
Heads up, there might be a remnant in that site. There's a cat device here, Pathfinder. Shooting the device will destroy it. Externally. To where? I can't determine that. However, there may be devices at other remnant locations. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. The ambient temperature is normal. Life support restored. That many siblings common to you guys? We have large families. Strength in numbers. Yeah, Krogan used to run that show. Careful. Angara technology is present in this camp. Scanning will provide more information. Bug should be feeding Ket information to the Resistance, but the connection was dropped. Why? A technical issue? Unknown. If you scan additional bugs, I can locate the broken link. That labor camp ski I'm talking about. Let's find Newt.
to get out! Freedom! I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Disable the fence, quick! I'm not getting away with this! Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Life support restored. The control panel is right there. Shut this down. Once I have a weapon, I'm gonna destroy these cats. Just in time. Would have given us another day at most. No thanks to Rana's jabs. See what I mean? We owe you. How'd you find us anyway? Your nephew Ski Out was trying to get you rescued. He's got so you've said before. The resistance needs to be debriefed. We'll head back to base as soon as possible. What about the data drive? We have to deliver it to Buxel so she can start the analysis. Interesting. It seems we have to depend on our rescuer for more than a rescue. Can you deliver this drive to Tetrix? If we work together, no time will be wasted. What's in the drive? A cat code we stole while trying to infiltrate their command center. 
The cat never realised how much we downloaded off their network. I'll go there as soon as I can. Perfect. Next soon we'll be in her workshop. I hope we meet again. Under better circumstances. This is big. Liberating key resistance agents and recovering information they stole from the Ket. You've put many doubts about you to rest, Ryder. Even Ephra must now be convinced of your intentions. What about the data drive Nils entrusted to us? Good point. If you prefer, you could go to Tetix now and speak to Ephra later. The choice is yours. I need to get this data drive to Tetrix. I can deal with Ephra later. I thought you might say that. Very well. We'll talk to Ephra when you're done with your tasks here. The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. like track if you back up far enough same as this one big rocks floating in the void and if you look closely aliens killing each other for reasons that don't seem worth it hmm. so still the same <laughs> Devices seem to be extracting remnant data and sending it to a single location. Can we track it down? It's heavily encrypted. I may be able to break it with more information. It's got the signal. This way. This is the source of that interference? Looks like a meteorite. The interference is caused by the EM radiation it's emitting. I detect that. Detect later. Adi. The signal emitted by that meteorite might be drawing the Adi as well as driving them into a frenzy. How do we shut it off? Perhaps the scan will tell us more, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, I can modify your Omni tool to dampen the signal. We're not alone! <laughs> I suggest we return it to the Nexus for analysis. We could learn more about the Scourge. True. Disrupting comms, driving wildlife into a frenzy. There's too much here to ignore. We need to study it. Hopefully the Hajara scientists won't have any more trouble with their comms.
I've been reading Krogan history. I have a few questions. Careful, Krogan have a saying. History is written by the victors. Krogan do? You're from Clan Nakmore, but you weren't born into it. You chose it. Yeah, the shaman of the clan was strong, and the Craddock wastes were beautiful. And you had a rite of passage. It wasn't so much a rite of passage as a death trip. I survived. Now, I'm Nakmore Drek. I'm detected below normal temperatures. Site. Could have a few lurkers. Fight, Jal. What's your training? From my father. And older brothers. And sisters. And cousins. My mothers. The Resistance isn't an army. It's more than that. <laughs> what was your right of passage? I fell in love when I was a young man. Very young. We met on a farm on Aya. She was brilliant. And her eyes were electric. For years, I suffered with a broken heart. Not what I was expecting. Mm, I understand completely. zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. So your granddaughter, Kesh, is superintendent of the Nexus. 
I thought the Krogan all left. Nexus Brass would have loved to see Kesh off that station with most of us. My Rushan's special. She's keeping them honest. This remnant site has defenses in place, Pathfinder. Why was your galaxy called the Milky Way? It's not. But Liam said it. <laughs> Milky Way is what the humans call it. We have our own word. Salarians have theirs. So, what do you call it? It's 600 years away. I call it gone. Good to be on solid ground again. You don't feel exposed? Pathfinder, I the detect heavy weapons fire everywhere. Nearby. I'd rather face them down here than stuck in a can up there. Pathfinder, I detect heavy weapons fire nearby.
Pathfinder. I detect heavy weapons fire nearby. Get ready to fight! So, the Pathfinder. Here to convince us you're a friend. If that's the goal, take my advice. Don't join fights that aren't yours. No thanks necessary. I was just passing through. Good. Keep passing. Mind yourself out here. Not everyone sees the difference between you and the kit. Here's a hint. I'm the good-looking one. <laughs> added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Blasted to bits.
environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Two to go. I recommend scanning the body. The cat planted a chip in this Angara. Tracking chip? Can you reverse it to get an F1? The chip is disabled, but if I receive more scans, I could repair the signal. carrying power a long way.
I'm reading a temperature decrease. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Another memory trigger? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. Approaching a resistance emergency medical cash pop. That's two of them. Pathfinder. Life support restored. Did you get anything from that, Sam? I've added it to my database. I still need more information to repair the tracking signal. this mountain. the cat we had solarians there's always someone thinking they're better than you i don't know many solarians but they seem nothing like the cat you're right you don't know many solarians
down any of their defenses. Many lives were lost in trying. If there's any way we can help the Angara deal with the cat, we're gonna do it. Get me up there and I'll take those bastards myself. are within acceptable limits. Life support is back online. Need more glyphs. Wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. I detect no additional glyphs in the area. Interface successful, Pathfinder.
I am dying, though. <coughs> Sorry. A while back, you asked why anyone nearing the end of their life would come all the way out here. I've lived a long time, seen a lot of things. I know I won't see much more. I guess I just want to go out seeing what no Krogan ever has. I respect that. It's an honor to fight by your side, Drac. <sighs> Feelings mutual. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Don't drive us off this cliff, kid. Relax, I got this. I have always liked Vold. It is harsh, but beautiful. Outside temperature is in free form. An undocumented mineral has been detected, Pathfinder. There is a resistance emerging. Seems like you could skip the battle and keep alive. 
If you call that a living. Save the rest of the Milky Way species. One too many for some of us. Hey, can you help me with something? There's a wraith clip. That's Tetrix, according to my map. Let's go tell Buxel about her brother. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. here to observe the Yavara. What are the Yavara? Walk onto the frozen lake and you'll see them beneath the ice. They've lived on fold for millennia. Stories about the Yavara are the only Angaran folktales that survived the scourge. They're beautiful, intelligent creatures, our closest tie to our past. I worry about and now your people will poach them right out of existence. I haven't heard any reports of the initiative hunting on Vold. Not the initiative. Outlaws. They've killed two dozen in the months since they've landed. We have no resources to track these poachers, and the resistance is spread too thin. At this rate, our only link to our history will disappear forever. Ryder, the Yavara are vital to our current culture. We need to stop these hunters. We'll do whatever we can to help. You said you have folk tales about the Yavara. Somehow, Yavara stories are the only ones that survive the Scourge. Most of them have the same theme. A Yavara song is so beautiful, it can coax the sun out of hiding, reveal the stars. Just stories, of course, but when your entire history is lost, stories are precious. I see why the Yavara are important to you. To all Angara. They're a symbol of what the Scourge took from us. We can't lose them. Tell me more about the Avara. They're amazing creatures, able to communicate through intricate songs. Long ago, we could have heard the songs in person. But the Scourge trapped the Avara beneath the ice. Now we have to settle for static-filled recordings. How do they survive under the ice? No one knows. We've dedicated our lives to studying them, and we still can't find the answer. They're cut off from food and oxygen, yet they still persist. My colleague here has a theory they may be remnant. We have no way of confirming this, of course. I'll leave you to your work. It's all right. 